The push for sustainable development in Africa has been a key part of major conversations among African leaders. It spurred the recent Global Business Africa initiative held in New York. In the fireside chat with Alinko Dangote, he emphasized the need to accelerate trade in Africa and enhance agricultural infrastructure. When you talk about Africa, the biggest thing about Africa is agriculture. So now, how can we talk about agriculture being the biggest in Africa if we don't produce our own fertilizer? You know, so in the last couple of years, uh, in sub-Saharan Africa, we had zero fertilizer production, which is urea mainly. And both ourselves, we now built 3 million tons capacity. There's also another company, Indorama. Indorama also built another 3 million tons capacity. So we're able to make Nigeria self-sufficient and we're able to serve other African countries and we export out to uh, U.S. We meet at a crucial time. The Deputy Secretary General of the United Nations, Amina Mohammed, and Musa Faki, Chairperson of the African Union, in their speeches urged African nations to prioritize sustainable development goals, outlining a vision for unity and encouraging international partners to recognize Africa as a hub for innovation and entrepreneurship. The first of these areas will be unlocking inclusive of growth through trade. The African continental free trade area offers a framework to create the largest single market in the world. And we're going to explore how to break down the barriers, foster economic integration, and build regional value chains, ensuring that no one's left behind, especially our amazing women and youth and our marginalized communities. From its rich and diverse cultures to its vast landscapes, and the resilience of its people. Africa's story is one of determination, progress, and unwavering hope. Africa is also a continent of economic opportunity and must claim its ambition to drive innovative solutions and contribute facing the world's most pressing challenges. My country, Nigeria. In his keen yet gentle speech, Nigerian economist and current serving president of the African Development Bank, Akinwumi Adeshino, spoke on bridging several technological gaps between Africa and the world. We need data. Without data, you don't have AI. So building that whole data ecosystem, and that's one of the things we say we'll do together, is important. Second one is just the skills, right? The skills we need to have science. Um, uh, uh, technology, engineering, mathematics, have a lot more women or girls actually going into these fields to remove another divide, which is, which is gender-based divide in that particular area. I think that's important. Initiatives like this that bring together influential individuals and decision makers from various sectors play a significant role in unlocking Africa's ultimate economic potential and sustainable development. In Lagos for New Central, Chidima Ona.